guys, so I just wanted to show what I've done here. A lot of changes. This originally was planned to be a kind of like refrigerator area. We thought it'd be cooler and we were gonna slide it out and all these other things, but that has changed over time, multiple times. So I finally ended up on this. And what we did, and I saw this on YouTube, which I thought was a fabulous idea, is I've got a fountain pump down in here. So this bottom is a fountain pump sitting in a five gallon bucket. Right now, this is just for, for using temporarily. We'll get a nice clean one when we start it. But the pump actually is fed into the water line here. So we do dry camping. Uh, so we have no hookups or anything like that. So the idea is just with the power in the solar, we can actually turn that pump on and then the water comes out. Now granted, it's not a huge uh, power. Um, as far as how much water is coming out. But you see, once I turn on the power, that comes on. And then this, turn on, and we've got water. Again, it's a little drip of water, but what we will normally use uh, would just be for washing dishes, maybe brushing your teeth, things like that. We're not like trying to pull on that crazy stuff. Can you get down underneath here and I'll show you what I did here? So down below, this actually, uh, right now it's stocked up so it's it's not being not running through but this would go through here you'll see it, it comes in so that actually flows down through this tube and just right out the bottom of the trailer it's actually down underneath so what we're going to do i'm going to turn it off so we don't have to stay on here uh what we'll end up doing is uh capping this little thing off here so at the bottom this little piece comes out. This is still drying, so I'm kind of trying to be sensitive here, but. So this part will remove uh, as we stop and go, and then I'll have a cap. You want to come in onto this a little bit and see that that goes out to the outside. So this I'll end up just capping over the top of that to be able to show, to keep any sort of road, anything out from there. And so then when we stop, I'll slide this uh, bigger piece of PVC, we'll go in there and then act as the drain basically. I did as best I could to make it go straight down. It's not 100%, but as you just saw, it does work. So we'll end up with a little switch basically so that the water turns on with a power switch instead of the switch for the actual, you know, the faucet thing. So. Just thought I'd share a little bit. Uh, I'm getting really close to finishing everything up and then I'm gonna share a full like whole camper uh, trailer tour shortly. But thanks for watching. Subscribe, like us. Uh, hope you're enjoying the videos. Thanks.